Hello survivors and welcome to another Walking Dead Road to Survival video and in this video I'm going to be doing some pulls on the new Limit Break wheel if you haven't seen it already there is a new wheel in the game and basically it has increased odds you have to pull it with these bomber tokens which you have to purchase in the store but you can see the increased odds 6% of for a gold mythic rather than the normal 1% which is obviously great it is worth noting that you can only get up to 210 pulls, so if you buy all the available bomb tokens, that's the most you can actually get. If you haven't already, any purchases will go towards other things. For instance, I managed to get the key for the Mirabelle event because of purchasing the bomber tokens, so I'm going to get sort of like the double down. I, I did hope there was going to be a step up recruit as well, and it would have been the same sort of situation, but... The Limit Break wheel looks pretty good too. It looks pretty good too. I have got just over 50 pulls. And the characters I want to get are pretty much just like... Princess, Razo, Connor. I think those three are like the main three. Um, but Razo and, and Connor are probably the, the bigger priorities. Just because this is it's the only place we can get them right now. Whereas I could get lucky on a Gold Mythic token pool for Princess. Anyone who's a dupe or not needed... I can sell now, obviously, because the Gilded Bits system has come in with the Bits store. But I would obviously like to get some characters that are going to be good for me. Characters that I haven't got to Tier 2 yet, um, or, or, gra or grade, grade 5, should I say. Um, so hopefully we can get something good. I'm going to do the first 10 on my boy Heath, the best controller in the game. <laughs> 10 coming in now. Hopefully we can get something good. 6% chance. Hopefully we get one gold mythic out of these 50. It's going to be an Antonio off the start. Hey, we get an Elodie. I haven't had Elodie before. So that's a brand new character for me. I'm happy enough. Oh, we get a Glenn as well. I'll take I'll take the double. I'll take the double. I have That's my second Glenn. Two golds off a of 10. Nice. Very nice. Can't complain. In the same screenshot too. In the same screenshot too. Not too bad. Two characters that I don't have to, to grade 5. I will be able to grade 5 Glenn with this. And my first LED will be, just be good. I think she's Militia. Oh, she's Young Survivors. Okay. So she'll just go towards my Young Survivors team. Who I've got Carl and Sophia for right now. So, yep. That'll be useful. We have got another 10. This time I'm going to pull on... I think I'm going to pull on Connor. I'm going to pull on Connor. I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind a Connor. I definitely wouldn't mind a Connor. Okay, here we go. I just noticed that Connor's hair is green, but I'm pretty sure on his maxed out character it goes pink. So he dyes his hair as he gets upgraded. Very interesting. 10 on Connor. See if we can get any more golds. Very, very lucky in the first 10. Cameron score. Hey, we get a second beta. That's another grade 5 character. That's nice. Second character is nice, especially for allegiances. Whisperer allegiance. Pete Anderson. We get a, another silver. I will take coal. Okay, so three golds of 20 pulls. I don't I don't know. We've got 30 more pulls. Will I get anything else from it? Will I get anything else? I'm going to pull... Who did I pull? I pulled Elodie, Glenn, and Beta. I wouldn't say any of those are like the top tier characters in here. Not just yet. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Who should I pull on? I'll pull on the first one of the ones I've already just, just pulled. So the first one through this that... I think it's going to be Beta. There we go. So I'll do a 10 on Beta here. This is 10 at number 3. Who that? That is the Governor. Dale. Silver Sadiq. David. Bruce Allen Cooper. Brian. Jesus, <laughs> yo Jesus, I think that was a league store Sandy there, Shiva, okay we didn't get anything off this 10 when it comes to golds, um, is this league store, it is league season 2, my god how long ago was that man, how long ago was that, <laughs> good jeez, and then we get the, the telltale character Jesus which was kind of weird, telltale character, um, but got, like, it was a, uh, not guardian shield, human shield, very powerful character once upon a time. We do get a silver out of this 10. But we want gold. So we've got 20 more pulls. We've got 20 more pulls. Come on, give us a give us one of the top characters here. Um, you know what? I think I'm gonna do a 10 on Michonne, so I have to 
Go left and then right. We're going to do the 10 here on Michonne. I've got three of Michonne already. So we'll be able to limit break this character. But... We want some, some new, new ones. We want some new ones. That is an Ivanova. Ico. Trip. Sleater. Axel. Come on. Come on. Dwight. OG Dwight. One of my favorite characters. Another Peter. <laughs> oh my god. We, just, we could limit break Peter if I wanted to. I don't think I will. I don't think his limit break's that great. Um, which is a shame. I think his limit break, he gets a turn. If it was turn one, if it went to a turn one on his signature move, it'd be good. But I think his rush basically just got an extension for the the hill reduction in slow, which is not that really that great. Um, let me, I can just double check. Um, yeah, one turn of hill reduction in slow. So yeah, not, nothing crazy there. Four gold mythics off of a 40 pool. Um, we're getting 10% drop rate. We've actually got more silvers than, uh, sorry, more golds than silvers so far, which is actually crazy. But I haven't got any of the top, top tier ones. None of the top, top tier ones. So nothing that's going to really make a difference, but it's good. There's good ones for allegiances so far. Who should we pull on now? Uh, I'm going to pull on Kelly. I'm going to pull on Kelly. We've had a lot of Kelly luck recently. Been getting a lot of Silver Mythic Kellys. Kelly's coming around right now. I think we do have like a single one pull at the end. This is the last 10. Deep breath. Come on. Give me a, give me a first corner or something like that. One of the, the big ones. Wrong princess. Clementine. Gov. Glenn. My girl Sandy. Wrong princess again, bro. Two princess baits, man. Oh, that, that feels bad. <laughs> That's just like get wrecked. <laughs> oh my god, the princess came out twice. Not the, imagine the right princess came out twice. Then that would have been good. Oof, oof. Okay, so that's two tens with no nothing on it. Two tens with a gold on it, and one ten with double. So we got we got pretty lucky. Um, we'll do this last single. I'll pull on. I'll pull on princess. Why don't we just pull on princess? Single pull. Could be it. This could be it. No. Harlan, six star Harlan. I mean, I can't be too mad coming out at four golds from 50 pulls. That's just above what I should, you know, the average. From 50 pulls, you should be getting around three at 6%. So, I, I can't be too mad. I can't be too mad. The ones I got were not spectacular, though. I got two beaters. At Glenn. Glenn's probably the best one. And Elodie. Honestly, I, wouldn't, I didn't mind the first three I got, but getting a duplicate beater, he's most likely going to be sold for guild bits. But otherwise, yeah, I got a lot of uh, a lot of gold mythics. Do tell me if you uh, you got lucky on your pulls, guys. Let me know in the comments down below. Uh, but that is the end of my video. I got a little bit of luck, but nothing too spectacular. I wanted that Con or Razo. Honestly, I wanted one of them two characters for sure. Uh, but that is the end of my video, guys. I want to thank you very much for tuning in. And as always, keep on surviving, guys. Keep on. Surviving.